So today guys, we're gonna talk about something na hindi ko siya actually ano, uh, forte pero maraming fan ng ganitong kotse I'm pretty sure there are lots of fans with this with this kind of car so today we're gonna talk about this Bowler Defender there we go Yun guys, good afternoon. This is a uh, good afternoon actually. Pero yun nga, medyo mabud na alam niyo yun. Medyo yun na, yun na. Uulan na naman. So guys, we're here in Clark. We're here in our good friend's uh, turf. This last night we had uh, a little meet with CS Reyes, Chino, and Dane, who's Dane, last night in Clark. Pero I didn't vlog it. Kasi uh, I just want to have a good night out. Tapos yun, uh, tumambay lang here in Clark. I use the Mini. Go from Manila to, to here in Clark, we use the Mini. It's really fun. It's really good na binyahin natin siya. We're just running around 80 to 100 to 120. Ganun lang. Tapos uh, parang happy naman kasi hindi naman siya nagkakaproblema. Hindi siya nag-overheat. I'm really happy. Pwera usog. Pero I'm really happy. So currently we're here in Clark. Uh, we're here to vlog some cars. There are two lineups for t for today, uh, but we will do a separate segment for that. So first, T, we're gonna vlog the D110 Defender uh, pickup. So yun muna for later. I'm gonna vlog an FJ Cruiser again, but this one's a Dapurak edition, uh, like a Dapur Dapurak 35. I, I'll, uh, I will do another segment for that but for now we're gonna talk all about the, the Land Rover Defender D110 pickup this is the D110 pickup uh, it ha this is like the bowler edition I'm not sure if you uh, might expert the Defender John uh, this is a bowler edition I'm not sure if it's an edition or it has the accessories of a bowler but guys this looks freaking good it looks freaking good. I mean, literally. Guys, ito yung mga coaching pang fanatic. Hindi siya yung para sa lahat. Guys, ang ganda ng body niya kasi it's a 110 pickup. Diba? Usually kasi yung 110 is like have, it has a full size SUV size. Tapos ito, pickup siya. So, yan. Kaya sobrang linis. Puti pa. Ang ganda. Pati yung, ma, yung rims niya. Uh, those are bowlers. So, Rims are bowlers, naka mud the MKM siya na BFG. So, ito yung, hindi ko sure, pero parang ito yung mga classic look na BFG KM2. Oh. Kasi yung ating nasa LC, KM3, iba yung ano, sidewalls. So, yan. Even the under chassis are really freaking nice. Sobrang linis, guys. Ayan, oh. I'm pretty sure nakapalit na rin ito ng shocks. So, yan. Uh, I think those are this thing. So, yan. Bowler na rin yung side rails niya. Alam niyo yung ganitong mags. Binabagayan lang talaga. So, I mean, this one's really fit talaga siya sa Defender. So, it really looks nice. And so, the overall look of the car is freaking good. It looks really good. Oh, so, pinatitrail din to sometimes. Yan, it's not worn siya na Zion and 10S. This is pretty expensive. I'm pretty sure it's not worn na to. So, yan, meron din siyang Defender na parang bash guard. It's bowler emblems. Guys, ang ganda. Ano to eh, yung mga modelong ano to, Defender. Kasi, uh, we have another friend na meron siyang D110 uh, Defender. Ano siya, parang yun yung full-size SUV. Na yung interior niya, medyo modelo. So, medyo maayos pa. Ang comparable sa mga lumang Defender. Sobrang ano na, analog-ish na, medyo luma-ish na. So, this one is the newer one, the newer model. Uh, sorry sa mga Land Rover purists that are watching. I'm not really ex uh, an expert with Land Rovers. If I have like mis 
uh, mistaken information that I've told, please do correct me on the comment section. It's okay. I would, I, I won't, hurt, I won't be hurt. So it's okay. So yeah, and even the spare tire or bowler, and so ganda ganda. Alam niyo yung likod ng defender. It really looks nice. Yung lights niya, yung mud flaps niya is the whole aesthetics of the Land Rover is really really nice the Defender parang yung dating niya ibang iba so yan lights are really nice so yan alam nyo guys hindi ko pa to hindi ko pa to na walk around I don't know the I don't know how to open some stuff the windows yung mga ganyan so yung vlog natin is like not nangangapa tayo ganyan. which is good I mean I don't want to have uh, vlogs na scripted so this is unscripted guys so Pag nakikita nyo medyo di ako marunong magbukas ng ganito, it's okay. I mean, I won't, I won't judge. <laughs> okay lang sa akin. So, yan. Feeling ko, para buksan yung rear, we need to, like, take this off first. I mean, this one. Oh, this one's the hood. Totoo ba? Ah, hindi, this one. Kasi parang hood yung emblem, oh. Ba't ganun? Kala ko yung hood yung emblem. So, we need to... Pull this out first, but it cannot be pulled. Because there is something here. Ah, hindi kailangan pa ata tong tanggalin. Because it has a screw here, so no, we can't open it. Because kailangan mo tanggalin to, which we will not do that. So balik na natin siya. Yeah, so na balik nasa. So sayang, I want to go up pa naman. Ganda nung likod nyo, ano? I mean, na-open to. Tapos, ito, ah, this is a plate light. Tapos may rear cam siya. Ganda nung rear cam nyo, guys, oh. I mean, sobrang OEM-ish. So, yan. I'm pretty sure if you want to open this one, it's like, you're gonna do this or some stuff na ganyan. Tapos, wipa ko. Para sa, ano, sa mini, mga wipa. Tapos, naka-rigid siya na rear light. Tapos, naka, I don't know, what do you call this? Roll bar. I think this is a roll bar. So yan. Tapos guys, ito yung sobrang gusto ko sa Defender na to. Yung side niya na to, itong glass na to, para sa FJ40 na may ganyan siya sa dulo, which which looks really 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 nice. So yan. Tapos yung mga mud flaps ng Defender sobrang type ko, ayan no. It, it really serves the purpose. Sa laki nila, 'di ba? This bowler motorsports here. So yan. Tapos may roll bar din siya dito, full rigid, naka-rigid siya ng ilaw everywhere. So, ma'am niya naman kung ano ang presyo ng rigid, it's there. So, there there you go, the whole exterior look of the Bowler Edition D110 pickup is like this one. It's really nice, it's really nice. Ma'am niyo, so quick story, I mean, wait, ano yung muna natin pala yung front suspension? naka stain din, I think. Yeah, not this thing yet. So I think don't, those are uh, aftermarket already. Tapos naka under guard din siya. So yan. Yeah. Yung height niya ang ganda. Hindi siya ganoon kataas, hindi siya ganoon kababa. Pero medyo mahirap to umakyat. So yan. Yeah. Let's go in. Let's start the car. Uh, tapos yan, ang no? ganda. Ang hirap umakyat sa totoo lang kasi wala hang uh, step board, side rail lang. So pala Start natin kasi medyo mainit. Oh, by the way, yung key niya is like this. Meron din siyang alarm. Tapos, wala siya dito yung susiyan na sa kabila. Parang Porsche. So, nandito. Ayan. So, yun guys. I mean, quick story. Alam nyo, hindi talaga ako fan ng Defender. I'm vlogging this car, but... To be honest, I'm not a fan. Pero ito, medyo na-appreciate ko siya when I drove it. Kasi, really it, it really feels like a tank. Tapos, uh, ang sobrang addict sa Defender is my good friend, uh, si Peng, uh, Bukid Boy on TikTok. You know, kilala nyo yun, I'm pretty sure. Kasi, yun yung lagi kong kasama. Tapos, uh, yun nga, hindi, siya yung sobrang addict sa Defender talaga. Hindi ako. I mean, I'm the LC guy. He's the Defender guy. Na when we talk about it, parang oh ikaw anong 
game over car mo na 4 by 4 he's gonna tell you Land Rover Defender. And that will tell you like every day, any time of the day, na LC ako. Parang ganun. Lagi gawing, yun yung ano namin. This, uh, this alignment namin. Parang kanya-kanya kami doon. So, he appreciates this one. I mean, yun nga, tiyatawin ko sa, uy, ano ba yung bowler? Bowler daw is started from 1990 plus na para siyang aftermarket company for Land Rovers na sumali din daw sa Dakar so yun, he told me some little background about Bowler ito yun, even this one he told me na ito Bowler signature daw to itong mga to so it really looks nice, I mean itong shifters na to tapos yun uh, yun nga, I mean he's the one who's telling me the stories about Defenders, so yun yun yung part ng story ko sa Kotseng Defender. So yun. Let's go with the interior guys. I mean, it's pretty simple. Uh, walang arte. So totoo lang si Defender medyo ano sa discreet. Discreet lang sa mga designs ng ano na, ng kotse niya. So, as much as possible it will tackle what we know. So yun. Uh, ito yung yung gauge niya. Tingnan nyo guys. Sobrang simple lang. O, oh, diba? Actually, wala nang mga buttons for the gauge eh. I mean, ito lang ata. So, yan. Tapos, yung manibela niya, guys. I think this is aftermarket already, but it's really nice, guys. Spring Alex. But, you think yung proof of bowler dito? Spring, Al Spring Alex, yung name niya. Spring Affix. Ah, Alex. Good daw. Spring Alex. Good na. Pero siya motolita ng, ng mini world. <laughs> Excuse me, sorry. Tapos, yan. Uh, ito yung signal lights niya. Same with the mini, the horn is here. Tapos, uh, ito may light sa dito. I don't know what the, what's the purpose of this one. But, look, we'll check it later. Tapos, ito yung for the wipers. Oh, by the way, naka-sounds na to, focal. All the way, naka-pioneer, may so, rear, rear sub sa dito. Ganda, ganda. Tapos, oh, ang ganda ng clock ng Land Rover talaga, no? Parang sobrang analog if na susal talaga. So, yan. I want to close this one. Ah, this one. Ano ba? Try natin. Oh, hindi tayo. I don't know. Huwag na natin gawin. But this one, uh, ito yung sa, ano niya, bintana niya. Nandito yung switch. For the rear, ito nandun naman. Ay, for the other side, nandun naman. Ito, may mga ilaw siya. Tapos ito yung roof light, tapos fog lights. Yan. So yung hazard niya ng doom. Tapos air cons are here. So yan. Tapos, simple lang. Ito yung headlight leveler. Ito yun. Tapos yan nga, Bowler L32. Uh, I think it has a, it really has a badge. So, siguro Bowler Edition nga talaga to. I mean, I mean, I asked the owner. He told me that it's a Bowler Edition. So, I'm pretty sure it's a Bowler Edition. Tapos, sobrang laki nung center panel niya here. Tapos, oh by the way, naka Ricaros na to. Na Land Rover. Oh shit, di ko napansin yung Land Rover kanina. Guys, Land Rover talaga oh na Recaro. So, siguro ito nga talaga yung kasama niya. Sobrang solid din ah. Sobrang sarap ng upuan ah, by the way. So, yan. Features are minimalist. But, the, oh, by the way, the handbrakes are here. Alam mo yun, medyo weird. Tapos, ito nga yung angle nila sa Defender. Parang yung positioning ng feet mo is kind of balik, ah, balik ko. Alam nyo yun, medyo weird. But it's nice. So, yan. Naka rear sub din si Boss. Tapos, yan. Naka Recaro, Defender matting so yan oh the ceiling by the way is really nice i don't know the material uh, pero ang ganda ng material niya ayan oh ang ganda ang ganda ng material so yan tapos yung rear niya tapos nabubuksan yung salamin niya dito feeling ko kasi may, may ano doon lang so yan uh, quick story about the car i mean we borrowed it from our good friend here in clark so uh to try muna namin natin si Eco at ganyan and it's really fun I, this is my first time to drive a Land Rover Defender na Luma and yung Luma bago ba? May nila, ay wala pa rin so maybe meron kayo dyan uh, you want me to vlog your car just tell me so yan uh, this one's the old one pero still it's really nice I think ano to yung mga 2010 pa taas to and I think ay hindi baka nga 2015 pa to kasi end plate na eh so med medyo modelo 2016, 2017 na to Kasi lately lang naman lumabas yung bagong Defender, di ba? So yun. So yun guys. I mean, we're done with the interior and exterior of the car. So we'll do a quick Banawe Boy 
driving with Banaway Boy segment for this car. Kasi ikot lang tayo inside the compound. So, para lang maramdaman nyo. So, wait lang. Bye, guys. <laughs> This car is fun, guys. I mean, I think gas pedal. Sobrang weird ng gas pedal niya. To the point na magkadikip siya sa somewhere dun sa isang tapakan. Na medyo na weird na ako gamitin. Shit, di ko alam kung saan ako dito. shifter niya. Sobrang sarap gamitin. Natotoo ako. Parang ang ano lang, ang parang siyang laruan. So yun guys, I mean the car is really good. Sobrang happy gamitin. Tapos wala siyang blind spot guys. I mean yun yung good part sa kanya. Wala siyang blind spot. Tapos ang ganda ng ride. Tawin ko ako siguro dahil sa build stain na lang yun. Pero the ride it's pretty good. I mean, yung sa friend namin medyo matagtag nung nagtitrail. Siguro pag tinrail ito, medyo matagtag din ito. Pero, so far it's good. I mean, the car is nice. The car is nice. The car is nice. Sobrang saya. Sobrang okay gamitin. So yun, uh, we just went for a quick driving with Banaway Boy segment with this car. So, explaining the feeling of having of driving one is somehow I could compare it to like somehow yung mga diesel na parang tank hindi ko kasi hindi pa ako nakadrive ng tank eh pero the feeling niya yung bigat ng ganun I mean yung ganong feeling na medyo mabigat tapos diesel tapos medyo ganun kailangan pero may torque it's really torquey the good thing about defenders yung sinasabi sa akin is the body is aluminum if I'm not mistaken tapos yung center of gravity of the car is really perfect tapos yun nga I mean yung torque niya yung power niya is there so that it's really good for trails 
So, I have a fan of Defender because the history of the car is brought by Land Rover all throughout the car. I mean, pag tinig na mo siya, it really looks the, the same with the old one. So, meron yung ganong feeling, yung memorabilia feels of the Land Rover Defender. So, kahit modelo na, imagine mo 2017, ganito pa rin yung itsura niya. But, there are a lot of improvements compared to the latter models. But, ang nakakatuwa sa kanya kasi lahat nandito. You, what, you get what you need. Hindi mo, hindi, hindi na, hindi siya maraming tech stuff, but you get what you need. So, it's another thing, it's a good thing ko anong meron dito sa kotse nito. But, at least ngayon, alam nyo na yung feeling, di ba, ng driving with Madame Boy with Land Rover Defender. That's pretty sick. I mean, we, we don't get uh, like a chance every day na makadrive ng Bowler Edition Land Rover Defender. So, yun. Guys, ang ganda. <laughs> Medyo na-appreciate ko bigla yung Defender nung na-drive ko. So, if you have a chance of driving one, please do. I mean, para lang maramdaman nyo kung anong feeling. So yun guys, thank you for watching. P please do like our video. Subscribe on our YouTube channel. Manawe Boy No Space and like and follow on our Instagram and Facebook. Again, Manawe Boy No Space. Again, oh, Griff Manila here for the shit. Guys, thank you, thank you for watching. See you guys next time.